In today's video, I want to talk about and shed some light on these women that are choosing a dark path and then in their old age coming out saying they, you know, are lonely, don't have anybody, they don't have any support. Let's talk about it. to another righteous spiritful episode today i'm back at it in them trenches handling that kingdom business man you know i want to point women if you are prideful and single man i want you to go read ruth you know chapter one chapter two and chapter three ruth is not a long book but in here, man, you see a woman that loses her husband. She's a widow. And then that loneliness sets in after being a widow. And then due to her righteousness and obeying the will of the Most High Yah, she's able to remarry and do away with that loneliness to be able to find support once again but it was a process. Man, there's not nowhere in the Bible that supports a woman being uncovered. Man, it's truly sad. I know some people would, you know, it's very easy to immaturely make fun of it, to laugh at it, but it was the Most High Yah's will for a woman to be covered from the cradle to the grave, from birth, the father. A lot of these women that choose the path of anti, you know, anti-men or I don't need a man, they didn't get that coverage in the beginning. This is why I tell men, man, show up for your kids. Even if you're not on, you know, uh, even if you're, you're paying child support, man, spend as much time, work to create a relationship with your child's parent to where your daughter's mother, so you can spend more time than even the agreement says. Because, man, these women are choosing the path of not wanting to be with men and then when a little bit of age sets in, a little bit of maturity sets in, they realize, man, I prioritized all of the wrong things. I'm not saying that their accomplishments are, are not worth it or not uh, valuable in some sense, but the order in which they went about conducting their business. Bro, I, it's sad because I don't want no daughter of Zion out here uncovered. That could only be, be be bad for her. You're gonna be a victim of all of these problems and all of these increased tribulation because you don't have no support system. You know, the father covers a woman all the way until a man is taking her hand in marriage and then the handoff is complete. The father must be there to vet, to make sure, hey, I'm not giving my daughter away to you. You's a plum fool. You know, the word says, give your daughter away in marriage to a man of understanding and you would have accomplished a great task. Some women don't have that, man. Man, I'm gonna post a link to a video, you know, from River TV, you know, shout out to River TV for the works that she does, you know, trying to shed light. But I'm gonna post a video because here you have Tiffany Haddish, who is successful. You know, she's she's made a wave in comedy. But she is disclosing, you know, I'm out. She says, I'm out here learning on my own. I don't have no support. I don't have a man. 
I don't have X, Y, and Z. So I move differently. And she said that in response to something having to do with her going over to Israel to see for herself. Here's the thing, man. I posted a video about a Israeli uh, American citizen, a teenage boy that lost his life going back to see his roots. He wasn't welcomed over there. What I'm saying is, if you are a single woman that chooses this path to be uncovered, you're not going to have anybody to, to say like, hey, maybe now isn't the time to travel over there. Man, I would hate for somebody like Tiffany Haddish to go over there and not to be able to understand on a protection level, a man being a protector, you know, the threats that are over there. A woman might go over there and look at all of the vanity and say, oh, this is beautiful, not realizing just like they were dropping bombs on Baghdad. Man, they're doing the same thing in Israel. So a woman that's uncovered, man, the learning curve, she's almost like behind the learning curve because she's gonna endure more suffering and more tribulation because she doesn't have a protector. That's what I'm getting at. Man, I don't enjoy, I don't get it. You have some men that get a thrill out of these women hitting the wall, I told you so. But man, that's another soul that's not covered. Man, the word says a woman shall be saved if she continues on in childbearing and in holiness. It was never the will of the most high y'all for these women to be out here uncovered. But man, I try to I try to change the message, you know, because Man, I, I I pray to the most high y'all. I raised my daughter up letting her know my daughter is 10 years old right now. And I raised her up letting her know that I am raising you up to be a wife. I'm raising you up to be submissive. The same thing when, when we address issues and she tries to back talk me and is disrespectful, I'm letting you know that's not going uncorrected because it's going to result in you being loud, obnoxious, arrogant, and and lawlessly prideful to the where you're uncovered and no man don't want you. What father want to see his daughter out here uncovered? I got two sons and I'm raising them up. Hey, you got to be leaders out here. You can't be on no doggone BS. The most high y'all, man, gave you a, 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 a job to cover women, to cover a woman. But yeah, man, I take no three a lot of seeing these women Talk about their struggles. Man, I take no thrill. Ooh, that tea's hot. Woo! You know, take no thrill in seeing these women have mental health breakdowns, crisis, but oftentimes it's self-inflicted. And statistically, man, if a woman does not have her father in her life and he does not teach her according to you know, to the will of Yah, man, there's a high probability she's gonna choose the world. Rather than just being in the world, she's gonna choose to be of the world. And especially Western culture is promoting these women being uncovered. That's a painful life. That's a dark journey. Your water heater go out, you ain't got nobody. You lose your job, you don't have no support. You, you, are, you are saying, you know what? I want to be the protector I want to be the covering. I want to be the feminine. I want to be the masculine. Man, that is tiresome. That's tiresome. I'm, I'm thankful. I'm thankful that the Most High Yah, you know, put my wife in front of me and allowed me to have the spiritual maturity to, to be able to recognize that's the one. I'm not saying I'm perfect. I'm not saying she's perfect. But if we keep our eyes set on righteousness and doing the role that he outlined us to do, man, we'll be all right. It's that easy. Closer to y'all ministries, kicking that thing gun barrel straight. Wow.